And I believe everyone saw the dust up between Doug Marone and Jalen Ramsey this weekend. He's about to tap old boy out. We can't have that between coach and player. But they got me thinking, like, what are the best fits for Jalen Ramsey? Because you know he's going to get traded soon. So here are my top three. The okay. Los Angeles Rams at number three. I got the New England Patriots at number two. And then the Kansas City Chiefs at number one. What do okay. you think? Okay, well, first off, I mean, I want to challenge number three and number two. I mean, the Rams got Marcus Peters and Aqib Tlaib. I mean, what do you want them just to have every good player in the world on I their mean, team? I mean, well, when right. the Patriots already just traded for A.B., I mean, I feel like if Sean McVay is going to play chess, if you see A.B. on one side, you need to make a comparable chess move, which means go get Jalen Ramsey. Okay, I mean, listen, I'm not mad at you, but mm -hmm. I, I first off, they have some salary cap issues, too. I don't know if they have the money to sign them. True. That would be one thing I'd push, push against you. And, damn, I didn't know you were just putting them in the Super Bowl already against the Patriots, but Well, okay, I think if you go get Jalen Ramsey, you already got a, a solid offense. People have been worried about Ty Gurley, but Malcolm Brown has been balling. You had another cornerback to that mix to be able to line up against all those Patriots wide receivers, then we cooking with Crisco, dog. Okay. Oh, hey, listen, I'm not going to argue any of those facts because Jalen Ramsey is the best corner in football for my money. So I, I hear you there. I just – I don't see that happening. Now, number two, the New England Patriots, yeah. they're another team. It's the best secondary in football, but I hear you. I don't think it's actually that far-fetched. I wouldn't be shocked if the Patriots did make a call down to Jacksonville and now maybe traded it. away one of their wealth. Uh, they have a, a plethora of secondary players. So maybe well, who cares if they trade a, trade a first-round pick, right, for yeah. Jalen Ramsey? We know it's going to be like the 29th, the 30th, 31st, or 32nd pick. So I like that one. I don't love it. Yeah, Your I mean, because the Patriots won. don't need them. But they're, I mean, they're the New York Yankees of football anyway. I mean, just go ahead and stack up the best players on the team and then just, just pummel people. Uh, yeah, well, you're right. There's a part of me that, like, the, the, the Patriots are on such a different level right now. I actually just want to see them crap all over the NFL and just dominate everybody. <laughs> like, it's really become to that point. But I think I like number one the best, though, mm. T. I really do. I mean, come on. I mean, if there's one team that we feel like in the AFC that can match Brady and Belichick in a scoring shootout, we do think it's Mahomes, but at some point we'd like them to play to some defense. Right. And I think they could definitely use another guy in that secondary to take their take the pressure off their offense. And maybe their defense can yeah. stop a great offense from time to time. And we saw the Pats make the chess move. All right, we're gonna go get A B. So now our offense is almost on the same level as Kansas City. Kansas City needs to make the comparable chess move and go ahead and get Jalen Ramsey, like you said, and improve that defense because right now I give the ad, the edge to the Pats. Yeah, I, I get you. I would, too. I mean, they, gosh, right now it's looking like they're going to go 16-0, and which I'm scared to death of. But, all right, I just want to throw two other teams at you. The Philadelphia Eagles, you saw them getting toasted all over the field uh, on Sunday yeah, night football true. against the Falcons. They could use a shutdown corner. But they and may need to do... trade for someone to protect Wentz because he's out there getting broken up, Buck. He, he definitely is, and he's got to change his style of play a little bit. And another one I'm going to throw out. You saw it last night. The Cleveland Browns, just like Kansas City Chiefs, they're kind of – they're just open the window for the Super Bowl just this year. They got Odell. They got these offensive players. Can their defense hold up against the elite offenses in the NFL? That boy, Miles Garrett, is eating on the D-line. But, yeah, if you add another awesome. cornerback to that mix, yeah, it gets sexy for the Browns. I like it, though. I'm not mad at you for your three. Pretty good. Absolutely.